Hey y'all, this is my this is my my house. Come take a look. Um, so that's our house. Uh, a couple trees in the front yard, and we'll go and take a look inside. A little bit of a front porch up here. Pretty common in Ardmore to have a look. You know, some some houses have a front porch. Um, we just use it for our uh, little bench and for our barbecue out here. Um, and then most most houses here have a storm door. So a storm door, and this is uh, this is the first room. Um, little uh, coat rack, uh, little fireplace. Uh, yeah, we use it as a dining room table or a dining room. Um, before Hannah lived here, uh, we used to have it as a our TV room, um, but we'll show you where we what we did with that. So in here we could kind of come in a little bit. Here we have the guest bathroom. Oh, let's turn on the light. Guest bathroom um, and full bath. This is the first full bath, shower, toilet, all that good stuff. And then this is the main living dining area. Um, we have our TV, kind of door to the, the side door over there. Um, and we've got couches and this is kind of the big living dining area with a uh, big kitchen, um, kind of some, old style, ranch style cabinets. Um, and then over here we have a bookcase on this side. Got some pictures. Um, but this is where we spend most of our time. Um, and I think that that's one of the selling points. A lot of uh, homes in Ardmore are really old. Um, and those who remodeled this 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 house um, uh, made this open kitchen. I think that's kind of a, a rare find. I think that we could use some updating, but I. I think this is one of my, my favorite aspects of the house. Um, appliances, all that good stuff. Uh, and then, and so that's from this angle, kind of coming back around, and this is the living dining area. Um, all right. And then this through here is the master suite, kind of connected off the main dining room. This is the master suite. Um, right here on the left is the master bathroom. Uh, his and her sinks, uh, a little bit of a mess right now, that's okay. Uh, and then in a little bit through here, so that was the hallway, and through here is the master bedroom. Pretty good size master bedroom, I'm, I have, I like it. Um, we've got both, uh, this one closet here and one closet there, his and hers closets for the master suite. Uh, and then, and so then adjacent to this is my office, but it's also the previous owners had it as a nursery. So it's kind of a, um, it was kind of built as a nursery. So it's connected to the master suite. It's kind of the adjacent nursery. Say hello to Banana Batman. We won him at a, uh, the Dixie Classic Fair, which is awesome. You should go to it. Um, so this is currently my office. Um, let's see, I'll go from this side, kind of take, it's got a little, little closet over here. We use it for, to store luggage, pretty small. And then if we kind of come around from this corner where the closet is, that's my office. And then full closet over there as well. One of the things about Ardmore is they've got like closet space is, is tough. Um, you'll find you, you know, it's, it's. With some of the newer homes, you might find a walk-in closet. A lot of the older homes don't have them, um, but yeah. And then kind of through here. So this was where we can't kind of came in. That's the main living dining area. This right over here is the front door um, and the dining our dining dining room and fireplace. Uh, and then through here is the third bedroom. Uh, we use it as uh, Hannah's desk area. Uh, office, but also our it's our guest bedroom, uh, kind of nice for for guests, uh, but nice nice and bright. Uh, and then right next to where we are is this little door. This is the door. Let's see if I got that. Oh, locked up here. This is the door down to the basement, but also the garage. So downstairs is a full two car garage and right next to it is a partially finished room, basement room. 
um, that the previous owners used for their office because they had uh, more family members, um, which I used to I used to study for step one down there. Uh, and then up here is the drop down uh, for the attic. Um, it's a um, it's a it's a drop down ladder up there. It's for uh, attic storage. Uh, we store some stuff up there. But yeah, stairs down to the basement, uh, full two car garage. And then I have my, it's actually, I'll take you down there briefly. It's a um, kind of a disaster right now. We use it mostly for storage. We don't actually park in the garage. But yeah, it's, it's fairly large. We have two car garage, which is kind of a disaster right now. But it's also got a workbench over here, which I use to do a lot of my projects. Um, and yep. And then over through there behind the pole is the door to the little side room as well. And we'll kind of come back up briefly. Also all hardwood floors here uh, and bathrooms have tile as well. Again, the first bathroom and then the main living dining area kind of coming through again. Uh, okay. And then this is the side door. The side door comes out. That's our neighbor. Uh, that's my car. This, so it has a wraparound driveway that comes to the front of the street, kind of comes down, uh, down next to the house and wraps around and uh, goes to the two car garage. We, like I said, we don't really park in the garage. Um, it is nice. I did when it was, when it's really cold out. Uh, we'll sometimes park in the garage, but nice, nice green backyard. There's the garage. That's the master, the window to the master suite. Uh, and then the other thing I really like about it, I don't know if you guys have a pet or anything, but um, it's a fully fenced in backyard. Uh, and those are apple trees. The apples are not sweetest, but they are apples. Uh, fully fenced in backyard in case you have a pet or a dog or whatever. Um, and then these are chairs because it just became sunny and Hannah likes to lay out now that it's sunny. All right. Thanks guys. Uh, enjoy your, uh, enjoy your search.